The voice consists of sound made by a human being using the vocal folds for talking, reading, singing, laughing, crying, screaming, etc. The human voice is specifically a part of human sound production in which the vocal folds vocal chords are the primary sound source. Marine Corps brass have said they want rifle squads to deploy with drones in the future. And if they deploy with this one, they won't even notice the weight in the pack. The PD-100 Black Hornet, made by Prox Dynamics of Norway, redefines small when it comes to unmanned aerial vehicles. The pocket-sized black or grey birds, which look like helicopters in miniature, weigh 18 grams the equivalent of three sheets of paper. Prox Dynamics General Manager Arne Sharp told Military. Com. They come equipped with day and night vision cameras and can be operated using a device reminiscent of a beige Nintendo Wii controller and an attached tablet. It's the smallest operational drone in the world by far, he said. From our perspective, this was developed to give the dismounted squad its own ISR capability, Sharp said. That was the big idea, and still is the big idea. And the Marine Corps is buying. Sharp said the service has already purchased a small number of the systems, which come with two birds apiece, for test and evaluation purposes. Marine infantry units got a chance to test them out twice this summer, at the rim of the Pacific Multinational Exercise, and at Marine Air Ground Task Force Integrated Experiment 2016, which took place at Marine Corps Air Ground Combat Center 29 Palms, California, in July. How the service plans to explore the capability from here remains to be seen. Right now we are in a very good dialogue with Marine Corps Combat Development Command and the Marine Corps Warfighting Lab to see how they think they want to move forward, Sharp said. And we, needless to say, want to offer them whatever capabilities they need. The systems, which cost $50 minus $60. Oh, oh, oh a piece, are already in use by the militaries of 19 NATO allied countries, he said. The drones can stay in the air for up to 25 minutes and can hold a digital data link for more than a mile line of sight. And while complex, they're easy to operate. Sharp said a marine could learn everything needed to launch and control the drone in two days or less. While the Marine Corps hasn't committed to a specific technology, the Commandant, Gen. Robert Nella has said he wants to create an assistant squad leader position in each rifle squad to operate UAVs and other technology. Marine Corps experiments with unmanned systems are expected to continue into next year and beyond.